Thanks for joining guys and today I have the 2021-2022 Upper Deck MVP Hockey Blaster Box. Um, now this is everybody's uh, childhood starter set um, and the first set of every new season incredibly late thanks to uh, yours truly. Let's open this guy. Um, yeah that's here's one of the cards that I want to get. A gritty mascot card. Anyway, um, you can pick up a blaster box uh, for only twenty bucks at any uh, given retail location like Target or Walmart, and they'll have fifteen packs per box with six cards per pack. Uh, let's get that off to the side there. Looks about right, um, and it is a decent amount of inserts. Uh, for beginner collectors in here with variants including uh, silver scripts, super scripts, black scripts, printing plates, uh, which never have I seen. Uh, you can also get a chance at uh, Rookie Redemptions, which I hope I can still redeem if I get my hands on one. Um, yeah, so uh, here we go. Um, as usual, though, MVP design, not not the greatest, not a, not a huge fan I same reason, I think it's been getting worse lately. But uh, there we have Gurianov, Cousins, Taylor Hall, Pierre-Luc Dubois, Panarin, and an Ice Battles variant of P.S. Suter. Uh, this kind of card, I, I suppose you're supposed to battle with it? I don't know. I don't know how it works. Like, do you go... Here's my P.S. Suter card. Um... Show me one of your cards? Anyway, I, I don't really even consider that much of a card, but we'll just put that off to the side. Uh, so I am hoping to get my hands on a Colors and Contours card, uh, serial numbered anywhere from 250 down to 3, um, featuring players like McDavid, Crosby, and Kane. Um, other subsets include uh, 20th Anniversary set, uh, Before and After, which actually looks a little bit depressing because you've got a picture of the rookie, and now it's like, 10, 15 years later. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, heart Attack, Mascot Gaming Cards with Gritty uh, and Chance. Honestly, like, who wouldn't want that Gritty card? Um, uh, Buchnevich, oh boy. Feels so old now. Uh, Sorokin, Cam Atkinson, Fabry, and... Um, hey, nice, a short-printed um, rookie card at Quentin Byfield. I don't know if this is a variant, like a different color variant or whatever, but... Don't really pay attention when uh, when they're not numbered, so anyway, that's a nice card to have. And then Ice Battles of Roslovic. We'll, we'll have a random battle with these cards later. Um, so exciting. Absolutely so exciting. Riveting stuff. We got Saros, Carter Hart, Anderson, Sean Moynihan. Ooh, there's a depressing card. Well... We got Ice Battles, Jeremy Swayman, uh, and this is definitely some kind of colored parallel. So, And behind it, we have a before and after of Andre Vasilevsky. Wow. Look at him. Wow, just look at this massive chin. He's got one strong jaw. Wow. Anyway, before and after. Look at this prism card. Amazing. Looks really nice. It's a great looking purple. Mm. Yeah, I, I don't know, you know, I didn't look this up, and I probably should have. I don't know if the colors are any kind of variant in themselves, but uh, we'll keep that there. Mm. A little shiny. I'm going to move this off. Actually, yeah, you know what? Nearly forgot. We've got to infuse one of these packs with Puck Luck. We are going to go... Mm, this guy. All righty. Let's move on. Oh, fingers crossed, guys. We got Killorn, Josh Bailey, Morgan Riley, Anthony Manta, Sorelli Ice Battles, and, oh, come on. Ah, uh, jeez. Got Howler the Coyote. Of the, uh, of the team with the worst arena in the league. I think 
think my apartment's bigger than it. The Arizona Coyotes. Um, I have no idea what this, these stats mean. Um, it says here, uh, the only thing louder than this majestic creature's howl is his paws on the drum. I mean, he really looks like a bear, though. Anyway. A little disappointing, but, uh, we'll deal with it. I mean, I, I feel like we've now burned our mascot card. There's no way that we're going to get a mascot, another mascot card. At this point, we, we're really looking for... Um, speak of the devil, I think this is a gold script. And, uh, you know, I didn't bother looking up... Um, you know... At least that's Comtois, Dano, Ben, MVP rookie, short printed, Radim Zahorna... This guy over there, Ice Battles, Feligno, and Anze Kopitar, Gold Scripts. Can I find it quickly without bothering everybody here? Silver Script Parallel, Gold Script Parallel, 1 in 70. Bam, we did it. We did it, boys. We won. I mean, this is turning out... I mean, this is why the MVP set is brilliant because it is honestly a fun open it is cheap even if you got a hockey box well what's the hockey box like 60 bucks i don't know anyway Darlene, Smarkstone, stone dvorak tarasenko we've got a some kind of alternate color of mckinnon and ice battles arvidsson i really don't know what these variants are maybe i should put them aside is that the only one I got so far? I guess so. Other than the uh, two rookies. Looks like we got another insert card. Kind of an, I'm gonna try to open them better. Uh, Faraby, Ram, Van Riemsdyk, Raquel, Weegar, Tyler DeFoley, Ice Battles. Let's take a look at the back of this card. All right, actually, let's do that some other time. And the uh, Jesus MVP watch Philippe Forsberg silver script cool 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 oh, I'm gonna look this up I really should have done my homework on this one attack before and after rookie redemption regular foil board nice battles. Eh, whatever. I don't care anymore. If I don't care, you shouldn't care. Brad Marchant, the rat. We've got Igor Shesterkin, Tavares, Anders Lee, MVP rookie, short print Zegris. That is a great pull. We've got Byfield and Zegris. Amazing. And finally, Ice Battles, Zach Parise. Once again, like I said, we're going to battle all those guys at the end. I don't know what's going on. Um, and maybe predict this year's Stanley Cup Finals. I don't know. All right. Lankinen, Kuznetsov, Taves, Verhage, Backstrom, and Max Domi. Ice battles. I don't know why I'm so psyched and energetic today about this stuff. Whatever, I guess. Got Quinn Hughes, Chris Letang, Dylan Larkin, Zaka, Provorov, and, and oh nice, Kreider, Ice Battles. We're also gonna take a look at the pack. Patrick Kane at the front. Not much at the back. Stats as usual. I'm liking the look of this card. Hornquist. Renton in Wood Points, Ice Battles, Drew Doughty, and a, one of the, like, the, the lazy silver scripts, the one that's, like, not actually silver. Now, these always, like, kind of confuse me, right? Here's the one with the foil. Here's the one with the crappy um, silver that's more of a silver ink, not a foil. I don't know. I, I mean, I know this one's, you know, less sought after, I guess. I don't know if you want to call it that. 
don't know if anybody really looks out for MVP cards, but... Oh. Jack Eichel. Nice. Uh, Brent Burns. Jordan Stahl. That piece of crap. Um, TJ Oshi. A Quinton Byfield rookie <laughs> ice battles. And for our insert, nice heart attack, Ryan O'Reilly. Beautiful card. Really loving the prism. It reminds me of the cards that I used to collect, like Marvel cards. They would just kind of have a little foil, little foil background. Gonna move that off to the side. Gonna move that there. Have both my prismatic cards on top of each other. Trying to open this without revealing. Victor Hedman, Sebastian Ajo, Shea Weber, Martin, Claude Giroux of Ice Battles, and that weird, stupid looking silver script, but not foil script of Clayton Keller. We're just going to stack that off to the side. Hey, you know what? Let's. Uh, Let's take a look at the Sebastian Ajo card. So, uh, yeah, here's the front of it. Eh, lots of flourish that I'm not not a huge fan of. And the back with a little bit of a stat there. Ajo's hat trick. Help Carolina beat the Blackhawks. 5-2. Um, but I feel like the Blackhawks were a very beatable team that season, maybe. Anyway. Final two packs, we've got Chabot, Johansson, Klingberg, Alex Tuck, Yanni Gord, and Ice Battles of David Perron. And for our final pack that's been infused with all the Rangers puck luck with Patrick Kane. Let's hope we get this big hit. Big hit, boys. Patterson, Bjorkstrand, Yossi, Hamilton, Stamkos, and wow, that puck luck worked. Holy crap. We've got a variant of the Blades the Bruin uh, mascot card. He's a brown bear, and it says here, to ensure that he never misses a hockey game, this rare bear doesn't hibernate. But he can hibernate during the summertime when there's no games. Anyway, that's really cool. I mean, this one's <laughs> like a foil version of it. The other was like... Uh, not like foilish, like hollow, hollow foil. I don't know what the differences are. Just right back to this thing. I don't care anymore. Anyway, so here, here are the hits of the box, and as promised, we're gonna have an ice battle. We're gonna have an ice battle right now. We're gonna be gently shuffling these cards, and we will take one from the top, one from the bottom. And uh, see what happens. It's going to be Steven Stamkos. What a matchup for Max Domi. Who, <laughs> who's going to win between Max Domi and Steven Stamkos? Here we go. Overall, Steve, Steven Stamkos is an 89 versus Max Domi's 84. However, he's slower than Max Domi. But he doesn't have enough strength. Their skill is just about their same. But Stamkos' awareness is better. So that means that, like, Max Domi's going to come in for a hit with his over, you know, with his amazing 91 speed. But Steven Stamkos, who's aware he's there, kind of, like, dodges him. And then Max Domi goes flying into the boards. Let's do, let's do one more. I don't know what's going on here. We're just going to... So we got Steve, Steve Stamkos winning that one. And we've got Suter. Oh, boy. Versus... Jeremy Swayman, how's this one gonna work? I guess it's a, a breakaway or a shootout. Let's see how this does. Uh, overall, Suter is a little bit better than Swayman. Um, better speed, better strength, better skill, and better awareness. So I guess Suter wins. I don't care anymore. Anyway. Um, we've got two of these guys. We've got a coyote and a bear. Uh, this bear, this team might be, uh, winning the Stanley Cup this year. Um, but if they don't, I don't know. Anyway, th <laughs> thanks for joining, guys.